This exclusive first look at Drive was filmed before the attraction was finalized. And if you're going to build something as awesome as Drive, well, making a mess is just part of the process. So with that in mind, please, excuse the dust. And now, on with the show. West Edmonton Mall. An incredible collection of shopping, dining, accommodations, nightlife, and certainly not least of all, entertainment. And you might say to yourself, with roller coasters and bumper cars, water slides and wave pools, that should be enough attractions for a shopping mall. Well, West Empton Mall would disagree. Okay, so add on a mirror maze, sea lion show, not one but two mini golf courses and a skating rink. The mall still doesn't think that's enough. In fact, even if you ignore the non-mall owned attractions like the casino, the cinema, arcades, gun range, 5D experience, and dinner theater, well, there are still 10 additional attractions which the mall operates itself. Or at least there were 10 attractions. The mall is bringing an 11th attraction to its already mind-blowing roster of leisure activities. In what was once home to one of the mall's four separate movie theater locations, the mall is bringing what very well might be its most adrenaline-pumping attraction. Canada's only multi-level go-kart track, and it's called Drive. The experience begins here in the lobby, where you register your name. And they're all unique, so if you want to secure that special racing name, you better plan to come and register as soon as this place opens. After you register and get your drive time, you'll make your way down to the staging area. And it won't take long before you're impressed. The track is 850 feet long, and it's surrounded by amazing art, and all the tags were done in-house by West Edmonton Mall artists. You'll definitely take notice of the impressive hand-painted art right from the get-go. As you settle in to wait for your turn in the staging area, you might just get a chance to see who has the best lap time for the day. Next, you're called down to the track, and that's when the excitement really starts to amp up. But before you hop into the carts, you'll need to watch a safety video. It tells you all about the different rules when navigating the track, and what to watch out for from the team members and their flags. Really, it's not that difficult. Watch for signals from the team members, and don't treat the vehicles like bumper cars. If you want to ram into each other, the bumper cars are literally right around the corner from here. Finally, it's time to don your helmet and hit the track. And what are some of the fastest electric go-karts you'll find? Is it fast? This did the phase one to phase four run in under 12 parsecs. Featuring LED lighting, adjustable seating, roll bars, and overhead charges to keep malt used up and ready to go. As mentioned, the carts are electric, Italian-made Sodi RSX. West Edmonton Mall's drive is the first to bring them to market. These are state-of-the-art Sodi carts, some of the most advanced electric carts available today. And they're all remote controllable, or at least remote configurable. The operators can limit speed, as they do when you first drive onto the track. Then, after all the carts are out and running, they open it up. And boy oh boy do these babies go. The absolute best part of drive has got to be the drifting. It's incredible fun to wrap around the corners in these babies. And the fact that the track is laid out over three stories is just plain awesome. Cruise up and down slopes as you try to get the best lap time. The real bummer is the food court doesn't offer drive through. 
As mentioned earlier, the art and styling of the track itself is simply fantastic. Scenes of New York surround you, and all of the graffiti and tags are done by hand. And there are even awesome little touches around the track, like dangling shoes. The kind you might see hanging from power lines. Drive features a fleet of over 25 electric carts. And all I can say is that it's pretty darn fantastic. The carts themselves are beautiful. And you can even find logos for other mall attractions all over them. And when you're all done your race, you'll get a chance to see where you stack up against other riders. And your profile and race times are saved forever. So if you think you can beat me, bring it on. Once you get off your cart and finish the race, the fun isn't over yet. Once this attraction is open, it will feature an arcade. Of course, it'll be one that's fully stocked with racing games. Drive will also feature party rooms, which you'll be able to rent out for a group events. And now that I've had the time to look back on my experience at Drive, all I can say is that it was absolutely thrilling. And it's not just the speed or the exhilarating feeling of drifting around a corner, it's the way they tie everything together. It's getting your own unique racing name. It's how beautiful the art on those walls look. It's driving up and down three levels of racetrack, which is so beautifully styled to look like a New York streetscape. One of the coolest parts of Drive is that even if you're not racing, you'll still be able to get a glimpse of the action. What used to exist as entry doors into movie theaters and skateboard shops have been converted into a viewing area. So once this area is open again, as you make your way down to Galaxyland, powered by Hasbro, you'll be able to stop on the way and look down into the track. And when you do, brace yourself you're about to experience go-kart action like you've never experienced before. From some of the fastest electric go-karts on the market to amazing hand-painted urban art, traversing a New York-inspired streetscape, and drifting up and down Canada's only three-story go-kart track at West Edmonton Mall's own Drive. Special thanks are nowhere near enough to show my appreciation to everyone at West Hampton Mall. I can't express how awesome it was to be the first civilian to experience Drive. There's so much to look forward to with this attraction. What aspect of it catches your eye? Let us know what you're looking forward to in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to our channel, give us a like and a share, and maybe even visit our Patreon page. And why not check out one of our other videos, all about the greatest indoor show on earth. West Edmonton Mall. Oh, and thanks for watching. <laughs>